Gamer, and if you don't already know, I'm making a lot of videos today, so they're going to be a little bit shorter than normal, but if you're wondering, what are we doing today? Today, we're making our very own bookmarks. I have one of my favorite bookmarks right here, a Ninja Turtle bookmark. And I like the Ninja Turtles. And if you like to read, there's a bookmark you like, and you can't afford it, make your very own. So what I have here is, if you don't remember, when I did my making my very own Halloween basket, I cut off these off the box. Now, if you listen to me and still have them saved, then here, we're gonna use them for our bookmark. So what you're gonna need for this is cardboard, tape, scissors, stickers, piece of paper, and if you want, like the Ninja Turtle, to have a little decoration on it, some beads and string. So, let's get started. What we're going to need is, you can tell I'm in a rush, we're going to need, i got orange all over my fingers, we're going to need one piece of cardboard. Here, pick out a nice good piece. I think this piece looks good. What we're going to need to do is we're going to, it's a little too big because of the box I used. It's a little big, so we're going to cut off this much. I'm using a pen instead of a sharpie or anything, so it doesn't bleed through. So we're also, if you are a young little artist, make sure you ask parents' permission before using scissors. Okay, now that we have our cardboard cut out, we're going to, we're going to trace where our cardboard is. We have traced our cardboard. Now what we need to do is go on the other end of the paper like this and trace the cardboard again. Trace the cardboard ah again. So now what we're that was awesome. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut up the cut out those two sheets of paper. You do not have to put your paper you don't have to trace it on the sides. I just thought it'd be easier to do it on the sides. So, I'm going to cut out those two pieces of paper. Sorry for any background noise. I don't hear ma many background noises, but sometimes you guys comment and say, I hear so much background noise. What is it? It's just the rest of my family. So, what you're going to do is you've got these two slips of paper. They're each going to go on one side of it, but first we're going to decorate. So I've got loads of stickers here. I'm only going to use my two favorite sheets. I'm going to use these ones and this one. Mostly this one. So, and you can write stuff on it too. There's no problem with that. Like, you can write... is what mine's gonna say. Mine's gonna say read and eat. I'm gonna put up some funny little foods on it. Let's do, I'm gonna do a teacup. Um, carrot, ah, ripping my carrot. Uh-oh, my carrot ripped. Kill it. A funny little mushroom. And then I'm going to put some, maybe like some hearts on it. Now I do like to read. For most people who know me, they don't even really know that I like to read. I love to read. Also, guys, you can use any kind of paper you want on this. This is up to you what you want to use. I'm using stickers and regular paper. I'm not spending too much time on it. Okay, now I'm done with mine. I'm only gonna do one side to it. So now what you're gonna need, I use packaging tape, and I'm gonna use, let's see if I can, if you use packaging tape, you're gonna see why I'm using packaging tape. You can use packaging tape too. So what you're gonna need to do, make sure this is all lined up and how you wanna tape it. Then you're gonna tape right, over it. And 
and like so. Okay, you're gonna add and fold it. Then you have it almost done. All you're gonna need to do is get two more strips like that. And what you see me doing is I'm gonna fold it over so it gets the sides of the bookmark. So kind of as if it was laminated paper. If you have a laminator, go ahead, feel freely, instead of tape, use the laminator. Because I do not have a laminator, I use tape. But if you have a laminator, go ahead and do it. Use that instead of tape. A laminator is so much better. I'm not saying go out and buy a laminator. Please don't, unless you really want one. Do not go out and buy a laminator. Yeah. There you go, guys. I've made my very own little bookmark. It says read and eat and has some fun little stickers. If you guys would like to see more stuff like this, if you guys like my videos and want to see more of this, please leave a like and comment down below what you're going to be for Halloween and what you would like to see me draw in my Mickey Mouse book. Until next time, see you guys. Bye!